It has been more than 48 hours since a man was shot and killed outside of Westside nightclub. Today, the nightclub's manager and soon-to-be owner says it would not have happened if off-duty police officers had been there. The shooting was outside the Silver Fox nightclub at about 1.30 Wednesday morning. That's where Channel 4's Francesca Amaker is joining us live. Francesca, the owner says he's not allowed to hire any JSO officers to work as security as his, at his club. That's right, this owner is fed up and he is eager for the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office to change their policy. He says that the, according to the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office, they are not allowed to work at any adult entertainment businesses. And this owner that I spoke with said he's willing to pay for three officers for the safety of his patrons. Now let's go ahead and show you some video from that tragic night. This is footage of that tragic night where a young man in his 20s was shot outside in the parking lot of the Silver Fox after getting into it with several people. The owner tells me his club had 15 cameras that actually rolled on the fight that night. He also says he had plenty of security inside the club, but with JSO's current policy that does not allow on- or off-duty officers to work at adult entertainment businesses, and his hands are tied. We need the same protection that everyone else needs as far as a business owner, and the right to hire officers is something that we desperately need. I think until that presence is here, we'll, st we'll have things like this that could occur. Even though we have our own off-duty armed officers that are out here, but they're not JSO. And coming up tonight, for the first time, you're going to see exclusive footage from that tragic night. The owner actually shared it with us. Also, we're speaking with owners from Wacko and Mascaras about their grievances with this policy. I'm live at JSO, Francesca Emmerker, Channel 4, the local station.